Hey, what's going on everyone? In this video, I'm going to show you how I insert a title block from a linked architectural Revit model into a structural Revit model. Here I have my structural Revit model already open. I've already linked the architectural Revit model and I've set up my plan views. If you would like to see how I've linked the architectural Revit model, check out the links in the description below. The first step I'm going to do is open the linked architectural Revit model file. When I open the linked architectural model, Revit prompts me with a warning and asks if I would like to proceed. This warning is letting me know that if I open the linked Revit model in the same session as my structural Revit model, the linked model will be unloaded from the structural Revit model. And I'm okay with the linked model being unloaded. Here's another prompt. Revit is letting me know that I cannot use the undo slash redo buttons after the linked Revit model is unlinked. I can reload the linked model using the reload button. And that's exactly what I'm going to do after I've inserted the title block. Here is the architectural Revit model, and the only item I want is the title block. I'm going to select the title block and hit the Edit Family option on the ribbon. The title block family opens as a separate file. I don't need to make any modifications to the title block, so I'm just going to hit the Load into Project option on the ribbon. When I click the option, a window appears with a list of projects that I have opened. I want to load it into the structural model, so I select my structural Revit model from the list. After the title block is loaded into the structural model, I get a warning. This warning is just letting me know that the title block can't be used in this particular view. You'll notice that the linked architectural Revit model has been unloaded. Now I am going to reload the linked architectural Revit model back into the structural model. I'm going to go to the Insert tab and then the Manage Links option. I'm going to select the architectural model and I see the linked Revit model and the status is currently not loaded. I'm going to hit the reload button to reload the architectural model. And this prompt is just letting me know that there are some coordination items between the two models that needs review. And now I see that the status of the linked Revit model has changed to loaded. And there it is, back to its original state. To verify that the title block family was inserted properly, I'm going to create a new sheet. To do that, I go over to the project browser, right click on sheets and select new sheet. I get this window pop-up that has a list of title blocks that are currently loaded into the project. The architectural title block I just loaded is already highlighted so I'm good to go. And there it is, I've created a new sheet using the architectural title block. And that's going to wrap up this video, I hope you found it helpful. Please like, subscribe and share.